Sorry to interrupt your cryosleep, but I thought it worth mentioning that I, your digital officer during emergencies, or Dottie, have detected an alien biorhythm on this ship. And just as I suspected, the aliens have uploaded a virus, which is slowly deleting my program. I'm available for guidance if you require. I'm now initiating security protocol Lipstick Servo Bunyan, which is a series of tests designed to evaluate your humanity and reveal any aliens hiding amongst you. I've determined that three of you are secretly aliens. Please look at your device and confirm your identity. Your device can tell you if you're a human or an alien, but not the identities of your fellow players. Unfortunately, aliens will know who their compatriots are, so you'll be at a bit of a disadvantage, humans. By my calculations, you will have 20 minutes before I cease to be. So I'd appreciate it if you could figure out who the aliens are and push the button. You will be our first captain. I have repurposed the ship's quarters into unique testing areas. You can be impressed now. Choose an available room and your desired participants. Let's all agree to meet back here one year from today, but without the deadly circumstances. Hurry up, Captain. If you don't make a selection, you will forfeit your turn. Time's up, former Cap. Okay, next Captain, you're in charge. Okay, let's get a move on. Pick another room and test group. There's less than 19 minutes.
building's history, know it simply as the Murder Hotel. The infamous hotel was run by a mysterious family for several generations until close In unrelated news, the trivia murder party killer is still on the loose. Up next, I just pooped my pants! This is your wake-up call. Prepare to die. Welcome to Trivia Murder Party. There is no social mixer in our hotel ballroom. You've been lured into a murderous game of trivia. Only one of you will survive. But surviving is different than thriving. I saw that on a Target pillow once. Alright, first question. According to legend, who tried to make their horse a senator? Use your device to answer the question. I'm talking to you too, audience. Almost out of- And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? The rest of you, come with me. And here are your bags. Welcome to room 105. Let's see who has ESP. Type in an answer that fits this category. Everyone else will answer too. And if anyone matches you, you die. And I do mean anyone. Answer time is coming to an end! You didn't answer! I can't have that in my game! Anyway, let's see what everyone else did. It's a match made in heaven, which will send you to hell! You're not going anywhere. You're a ghost now, but you have options. Keep playing and you just might steal someone else's life force and win the game. Oh, by the way, the audience is a player now and can win the whole frickin' game. If you're not ready now, you can join the audience whenever. It's like super low pressure. Let's keep moving. What is a primary ingredient of Worcestershire sauce? This. One of you is still alive. It's time. Salutations! Welcome back to the killing room. Ah, the lost art of letter writing. I'm going to dictate a message to you. Write down as much of what I say as you can. Everyone else will be typing too. And if anyone does a better job than you, you die. Okay, let me lean back in this chair and get my feet up. And we begin. Dear guests, many of you have complained about the hissing coming from the air conditioning. I assure you it is working just fine and that the noise is coming from the snakes in the walls. 
Poisonous snakes are very noisy. Time's up! Okay, now I'm just going to do a quick editorial review of your work. And here's how you did! But did anyone do better than you? Well, you failed. What is this garbage? I've seen Reddit threads that make more sense than this. Everyone can see that the dead players are ghosts, right? I'm not just freaking out. Let's try another one. How many strings do most violins have? Only a ghost got it wrong. I'll have to kill my writer. Let's keep moving. What was the first food eaten in space? This. Everyone again? You all need to be taught a lesson. It's my old favorite, chalices. I've given each safe player a poison pellet. Pick a chalice to drop your poison in. Pick a chalice already! It sounds like we didn't get everyone's poison pellets in the chalices. I guess I'll have to add a few of my own. Now it's your turn to play. Pick a chalice to drink from. Delish! Now let's see what you drink. Uh-oh, poison! The final round isn't ready yet! You're not all supposed to die before that! Hold on! You're not supposed to get a do-over if you die before getting to the final round? I better report this huge bug to QA. Anyway... It's time for the next question. How big is the eye of a blue whale? Time's almost up! Who picked... this? Follow me! Let's do a spooky handwriting test. The ghost of my Aunt Mildred loves to write words on mirrors. She has her own consistent handwriting. Now, Aunt Mildred is going to write a different word. But so will everyone else. Draw a word on the mirror, and maybe you'll trick someone into thinking it's Aunt Mildred's. Start writing on that mirror. Pay attention to the words as they appear, and try to spot my auntie.
so many convincing words to choose from. Now, type the word that Aunt Mildred wrote, or you die. Would the real Aunt Mildred please stand up? Eh, Aunt Mildred would like never say that. It's time for you to join my Aunt Mildred. You messed it up again? Fine, you don't get my super cool final round. <laughs>